So I think it's fair to say since the insect meal has been added to the DNA Bates range, it has been very, very well received. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can apply the insect meal to a PVA mesh stick, also known at DNA HQ as a stick insect. First off, grab yourself a small little container like I have here to work inside. Next up, grab the insect meal and pour some of it straight into the tub. You'll see straight out of the bag that the insect meal is very, very fine. It almost looks powder-like. So what we're gonna need to do is add a liquid to it. Now the Hydro Spod syrups are PVA friendly across the range, but I myself have decided to use the Callinus Hydro liquid. I pour a little bit of that liquid bit by bit over the insect meal and stir it with a stick until I get the right consistency. As you add your liquid to the insect meal, you're gonna notice that it changes color and goes a lot darker. Consistency you're looking for is very similar to a ground bait or crumb which means that you should be able to sort of press it together if you want to, but it should also fall quite easily through your fingers. Now, personally, I fish my PVA sticks between two and three inches long, and that is so that I can just conceal the hook so that when I cast the rig out, I know that it's gonna hit the bottom, there's gonna be a small amount of bait around the hook itself, and the rig will be fishing nice and effectively. But get experimental, you can fish these things as long as you like. So yeah, it really is a matter of preference. Once you've got enough insect meal inside the tube, simply put your thumb on the bottom of the tube, take the plunger and press the insect meal down towards your thumb. Once compressed, remove your thumb from the bottom of the tube and use the plunger to push the insect meal out into the PVA mesh. Holding the PVA stick in one hand, peel off a length of mesh and tie a simple overhand loop knot to tie it down. What you're really looking for is a tight and compact PVA stick, so spend some time tightening down that knot. Take a pair of scissors and cut the PVA stick away from the mesh. Next up, take a baiting needle that's long enough to go through both ends of your PVA stick. I like to put the baiting needle through the stick diagonally, so entering it on one side and finishing it on the other, so that when I thread it onto my hook link, it sits nice and straight and casts a dream. Take your preferred rig, I'm using a blowback rig for this setup. Slide the PVA stick down the length of the rig and pull your hook point into the bottom of the stick. And there you have it, the finished article and a simple way to use the insect mill within your fishing, which will hopefully get you a few more bites.